India's space agency, ISRO, has given the go-ahead for the launch of India's maiden mission to Mars on the 5th of November. ISRO's Launch Authorization Board cleared the launch of Mangalyan on Tuesday at 2.30pm uh, from Sriharikota. India has invested 450 crore rupees for its first interplanetary mission to study the atmosphere of Mars. The 56-hour countdown will start early morning tomorrow on Diwali. Don't be misled by the small size and low cost. India's Mangalyan is truly a chota bheem with a big punch. This tiny machine is causing the global buzz. This is India's first attempt and all it cost is about 35 million dollars. In comparison, America has several current missions operating on Mars, having made more than 20 attempts. The most spectacular is the rover called Curiosity that cost over $2 billion. NDTV caught up with the head of the American space agency, NASA. You have an Indian mission to Mars going up later this year called Mangalyan or the Mars orbiting mission. You have the MAVEN mission from, from NASA which is also going up, both atmospheric study missions. Exactly. Is it exciting to have two countries independently going to Mars, does it's, the risk distribution help? It's always exciting to have as many countries as possible participating in exploration efforts. We're providing support through communications, data, and uh, other types of things. So NASA so we're is in providing support to India we're, for the mission? We're in, we're in partnership in that we're providing communication support as well as navigation support. What is exciting the global community the most is this less than three kilogram instrument called the methane sensor for Mars. In over half a century of Mars exploration, this is the first dedicated methane gas sensor being orbited around Mars. The presence of methane, also called marsh gas, could be a clinching signature of the presence of life on Mars. Possibly what Chandrayaan has done here, we also be able to answer possibly unambiguously uh, uh, the uh, source of uh, methane and if it is there where and how probably we'll be able to answer much better way. I, I see a parallelism between Chandrayaan 1 water versus the mass of methane. India's first baby steps to the red planet could answer that big question. Are we alone in the solar system? In Washington DC and Bangalore, Pallav Bagla for NDTV.